Well, it's that time of the day. It's that time of the week. It's that time of the month. No, no, no. Not that time of the month. It's just time for me to go food shopping. This is probably one of my least favorite activities, but I try to get it done in one shop and make it last at least two to three weeks before I have to go back. Lately, with the missus being broken and my daughter being home more often, the usual fare of food in the house has changed slightly. Plus, my wife can't eat beef anymore, so we've been trying to make chicken and turkey exciting, which is hard to do when it's just... Ugh. I made some ash burgers out of turkey last night, but um, they were good. But, I mean, turkey burgers... And then what else do you do with ground turkey? Taco meat? It's all you ever do is fucking taco meat. I'm tired of it. So I've been looking for some more savory, um, or even southern dishes that I can make that aren't super spicy because my wife can't have a lot of spice either. Uh, that's why I'm making this video today. Guys, I'm looking to my followers for some help. What are some things you do? Uh, I, I have a slow cooker. I have an air fryer. I have an oven. I have ample time and a really good... Um, I'm good in the kitchen. So uh, if you have a recipe, link it in the comments below because I'm looking for some help. Um, I can still have beef, but my wife can't have pork. She can't have beef. She can eat chicken and she can eat turkey. And for the most part, she prefers boneless chicken. And we've been doing a lot of ground turkey. But I will also go as far as buying like a turkey breast uh, and making that if we had to. Or even a whole bird, you know. Uh, if there's a special way that you guys have to make it, I'll try anything. We're just looking to uh, reach out and get some better options, you know? So trying to do lower carbs. Uh, we have to include cheese because she loves her cheese. And I mean, I, who doesn't love cheese, right? Uh, my lactose intolerant people, I feel you. But, you know, get some lactate, God damn it. So we're going to go to the food store. I'm going to go to the smoke shop, see if he got word about the mural yet it's been about a week follow up with him and then we're gonna go and get our food shopping list it should be an interesting trip so maybe we'll throw some video in there well i opted not to bring you guys in the food store with me it didn't see too much good stuff plus i was on the phone with my brother mike for about the entire time i was shopping and i had to hang up so i can actually put my stuff on the belt I will say this much, um, the kid who rang me up today, definitely cool kid, uh, not a cool kid, but he's a cool kid, he's like, he did his job well, uh, I wanted to slap him first, he was throwing my stuff down the belt, but, but, he was funny, he was enjoying himself at work, which not a lot of people do in retail, um, I had bought a bunch of pop tarts, he goes, oh, which ones are for me, are these ones for me, and he put them under the bagging station, I didn't do anything, I didn't freak out, I'm, Given the good benefit of the doubt, because I believe he was uh, on the spectrum. So, you know, he was having fun at work. He was being extra, extra. He was going out of his way to try and make my experience better. So I, I respected it and let it happen. Then I told him I needed a big jug of water. He went and got it out of the rack for me, which I did not need, but he did. And he handed it to me to put in the cart. So then when I was ready to put my stuff, he said, all right, you can pay right here. I'm like, all right, cool. Can I have my last thing of Pop-Tarts that you grabbed? He goes... Oh, those weren't for me? And I'm like, no, nah, they were for me. But, you know, they are on sale. You can go get some for yourself. You got a job. You work here. Maybe you get a discount. And we had another little bit of back and forth. But um, I always tell you guys, go out and make someone's day. This kid made my day. And I think I made his a little too because I didn't yell at him for trying to steal my Pop-Tarts. I was like, hey, can I get those back? He goes, yeah, no problem. Here you go. And then I paid him on my way. But, uh... Yeah, I, I'm glad that I didn't record any of the stuff in the food store because it was a shit show in there. But the end result of food shopping, uh, 135 bucks didn't get me a lot, but it did get me a decent amount. I got a couple of uh, random things that were on sale that are going to be some extra meals that will definitely stretch the budget. Uh, eggplants are on sale. They were tiny, but they were they were good looking. So I bought two, and uh, we'll do some eggplant this week, I think. <sighs> What's on your menu? Drop it in the comments. Again, looking for chicken recipes. Hit me up. Much love. If you subscribed to my channel already, I love you for being back. And if you're new, man, hit that sub button. I do this shit every day. Come on back for more. Till then, I'm J-Dubs Arts, and I'm fucking out of here. Art to your heart. And sometimes your stomach.